Check out my new car. This is a 2009 Corvette. And because I'm a wired editor, not only do I get to drive an awesome car, but it's filled with gadgets. For instance, I've got a BlackBerry playbook in here, a BlackBerry, and an iPhone. And the car itself has been tricked out with special hardware and software. It's made by a company called QNX. Now they make the software that underlies OnStar and a bunch of other in-car control systems. This is a demo of some things that you might see in future cars. So here's some cool things about this car. Basically, it's running an operating system that lets it link up with devices that you've got in the car, with the car's own electronics, or even with services that are out on the internet. So there's a button in the middle here which you can press to switch the instrument cluster view between a tachometer, or you can make it display a map, or the album art for whatever music you're currently playing, or you can even view a weather report if that's what you want to see. It can stream music from a playbook, or an iPhone, or the car's own hard drive. It can even stream music from Pandora out on the internet if that's what you want. If you plug in an iPhone, you can control it using the multimedia console in the middle here instead of the iPhone's own controls. And because this is the same basic operating system that's used to power the BlackBerry Playbook, you'll soon be able to run apps much like on the Playbook except on the car. Or you can integrate Playbook apps with the car like the climate control system app that they've got on this Playbook here. You can even watch YouTube or play video games. Although, if you don't have my cat-like reflexes, I would recommend not doing this while you're driving. How much does all this awesomeness cost? Well, it depends on the car that it's built into. It's an option, but I will say it's available in some pretty cheap Chevys, so you don't necessarily have to have a bitchin' Corvette like me.